Okay, Dead Cells on the PS4. We'll, we'll call this a speed run. What we're going to do is there are some gates in the game that close 10, that close 2 minutes after we start the game. So what we're going to do is as soon as that timer, see that timer on the bottom right hand corner of the screen right there? It's above the mini map. It says pause, 0 seconds. So what we're going to do is we're going to try and make a big, we're going to make a bum rush. We're going to go as fast as we can and try to open one of those gates. See what's behind them. It's a timed gate, so I'm curious how quickly we can, how far much progress we can make in two minutes. By the way, up here, these are the um, upgrades that I've purchased with my cells. So that's a bloody blade up there, and that's a health potion. There on the bottom right, left-hand corner of the screen right there, probably able to see that. That's an L1. That is a health potion that I have not been drinking. I probably need to start drinking those. Because <laughs> I unlocked that health upgrade pretty quickly. I need to start emphasizing that. R1. So this is the progress I've made so far. I permanently unlocked the vine runes. I permanently unlocked the health flask. Now, there are a couple of other items that I've seen along the way that I can talk to or interact with. But I haven't unlocked any of the skills that are linked to those things. Okay, what do I have to start out with? A rusty sword, which is crap, and a beginner's bow, which is okay. So I have my, my typical base weapons. We'll worry about. Eventually, you'll unlock more weapons at this point. When you first start the game, you have the ability to unlock more. But for now, we're going to have to stick with these ran We're going to have to stick with these two basic weapons: the shield and the bow. Timer's going to start in just a second. Once I go through that door, we're going to be in a mad rush to open one of those timed gates. Let's see how quickly we can get there. Ready to go. Let's get moving. Okay, dead end. Let's get out of here. Up. Oh. Yeah. That's a roaring start. Eh, where's my map? Uh, let's go to the right. Nah, not that right. I can't stun these enemies by attacking them both at once, but I don't do XP. Get, get out of here. Dash. Drop. No, drop. I got another cell. So I got one cell by defeating that enemy. Going the wrong way. Is there anything up here? No, we gotta go up and around. Crap. Alright, let's go up and around. Oh, did you see me? I jumped, I did a dodge roll when I was in the air and I jumped through that. That was kind of interesting. And I busted through that door, so I probably shouldn't have done that, but that's okay. Here's my teleportation. That's my first one. Can't go through there yet, because there are no other enemies back at that. No other teleportation gates I've reached yet. Here's another one. Let's go as fast as we can. Okay, we're halfway there. Wherever we gotta go, we gotta get there in two minutes. Lay out. He just left for grenades at me. He's not a threat from up close. Once I get close to him, he's not a threat. Ow, that guy's a threat, though. Yeah, let's get around this guy. Jump! Okay, they're out. Got that. So I got another immobilization trap. Uh, let's get yeah, to keep going. Mad rush. We got 30 seconds to get to whatever gate we gotta get to. Yep, probably not gonna get there in time. Because I think those timed gates are only in secondary areas, not the, not the prison where we just were. And it's paused right now. See that bottom right-hand corner of the screen? Timer's paused. So I'll give us some time to get our breath. Okay, let's get the wolf trap over on the L2 button. So that's what the triangle button does, is that it remaps the wolf trap towards L2 instead of R2. And I'll show you what I mean in just a second. See that? Right now it's an R2 on the bottom right, left-hand corner of the screen. So we can remap that if we have to. Triangle. Okay. I gotta get a better sword. I didn't have enough time to go looking for one. I'm safe. We're still paused. Okay. Uh, so I have two cells only. Let's put them towards recycling so I can get out of here. The only way I can get out of here is to spend all my cells. Now I'm back to zero cells. In the bottom right hand corner of the screen, the little blue, the little blue white ball over there. I definitely want to get my health regenerated, so let's use that mutation. I'll probably need a better mutation later. That pile of corpses is me, all the times I've died apparently. Get my health back. And as soon as we go through this door, the timer's going to restart. Actually, as soon as we go through the toxic sewer, the timer's going to restart. Alright, let's do this thing.
Let's see how quickly we can get to a timed gate. I'm not sure we can. So if we so if we, so once we hit the two minute mark, we can go wherever we want. But for now, we're gonna go as fast as we can. Yep, timer's going. Teleportation. There it is. DSC, got it. Got a time door unlocked. Aliba, aliba, andale, andale. Look at all that loot. Upgrade one of my stats. I don't. Oh, I have. Oh, there are ten cells in here. Outstanding. Guess what do I want? I think I want more HP, frankly. Covers three of your HP after an enemy dies. I'm already getting two back. Uh, let's take the extra HP for now. So I have way more HP now, and I get three HP back when, an, when after an enemy dies. See that? It's in the bottom right-hand corner of the screen. Okay, so that's going to be useful. So we got to that door with 18 seconds to spare. And I don't know if that determines the loot behind the door, but we got plenty of it. So it was definitely worth it. So now I know. No other teleportations available. Okay, so there's nothing else we can do at this point. So let's go down. Because we can't go back the way we came, can we? Probably not. Nope, can't go back. If we can, I don't know how, so we'll just bail. So it's a one way. Good old fashioned dungeon run. Whoop, look out. That! We're off the bat. Let's get my health back. I got a little bit of health back. Look out. Look out, that! Can I crouch through that? Probably not. Okay, whatever. So I got that uh, trap I can probably lay down eventually. Whoop, that wrong way. Guess I got poisoned. Ah, you suck. So, he's po so that guy's trapped. So it was worth it in that sense. And I stunned him with my attacks here, so that's pretty good. Weird parallaxing they have going on here with that foreground effect. And let's see if I can get my trap on this guy. I can't get up there. Well, climb the pole, why not? Where is that thing? There it is. Where I trapped it. I'm going to need way more health now. It's ridiculous. Okay, uh, we're going to need to use that healing potion pretty soon. Let's see how quickly we can get that. Dodge! Okay, yeah, we got him. Oh, those stupid bombs! Okay, I need, heal I need healing. Okay, I needed that. Alright, doesn't completely heal me. That's unfortunate. Eh, I can throw it. That's right, I got arrows. Duh. Should have used those earlier. Look out. Okay. Ah, you're too dumb to crouch. <laughs> yeah, let's go up and around, see what I can get. Crap. Look out. Looks like I stunned him. Little crap! Ah, those things are killing me. Can I hit this thing through the arrows? Nope. L2. Wrong button. Can't get couldn't get through the rocks. That's okay. Whoop! Like, I'm not dead. You already got that one. So I can just so that's just a big old labyrinth. So let's see if we can go uh down. There don't seem to be any items around here that I can grab just to go down. Suck it. Stay out. Those scorpions are kind of annoying. We have to find a way to deal with those things more efficiently. Okay, uh, let's go up and around. We can get some health from these guys. Did I duck that? Ow! Okay, I can't. Oh, I can climb the pole. Okay. Let's go around. I have aerial control, right? Yes, I do. So I have aerial control on my jumps, too. This game's got a lot going on. Control's great. Crap. Got him. Pick up. What? what? Got the bombs. Well, I'm going to die pretty soon anyway. I'm not going to be able to get my goal. Hopefully I can spend my goal on something I can unlock. 
He has to climb these pipes. Whoops. You suck. No scorpions coming out of the ground, so that's good. Yeah, this is not looking good for me. I'm out of health potions. Yep. Uh, yeah, we gotta go down to the left. Yep, the only place to go is down to the left. That crap got cocky again, and I lost all myself. Well, all of them? Well, most of them, certainly. Maybe all of them. Oh, well. So what did I unlock, at least? I got a blueprint, right? It was an okay run. But at least I got a chance to do, a, do that little speed run through the gate. So that was useful. So let's see what I unlocked here. Uh, pretty sure I got him another blueprint. Doesn't that count if I die? Let's check on something. Probably doesn't count if I die. We might do another speed run. I don't know. I don't think I got. Did I get credit for anything I just did? Doesn't look like it. Yeah, I don't think I got any credit for anything I just did because I didn't buy anything either. But I did make it to the, did make it to the toxic sewers again. Well, let's do another speed run. <laughs>